you know who I am? I was in the area, as they say. What about you, Isaac Daniels? Why are you in the area? We're on our way back from seeing my father. He's in one of the resettlement camps in London West. Do you know what tomorrow is? Of course, sir. 11th of April. Ten years ago tomorrow, you killed the Prime Minister live on television. He was appealing for calm. He looked so pale. His tie was askew. We've got parades planned, curfews, executions, so... a curious day to go visiting relatives. Don't you think? My father's sick. There's a letter there from his medical officer along with our identification papers and our internal travel visas. I just wanted Zoe to see her grandfather one last time before he passes. Zoe. She's my daughter. She's 11. She was born before the pregnancy embargo. Is she the one in the car? She looks exhausted, poor puppet. It's been a long day. Well, I won't detain you any longer. Oh, one last question. Your daughter. What color are her eyes? Come, Mr. Daniels, it's hardly a complex question. What color are your daughter's eyes? You don't remember, do you? I dare say when the other agent handed her over with her fake papers, you looked her up and down and thought, is this what all the fuss is about? This is the war child. But the one thing you didn't take in was the color of her eyes. And now, of course, you're thinking that you've taken too long to reply, and so instead, you're calculating the chances of fighting your way out, and which of us to disable first. You won't win, you know. I think we already have. Humanity will survive somehow. You can't kill us all. I don't intend to. <laughs> 